hello friends today i am going to explain how self start works in a four stroke engine as you can see it is a cross sectional view of a four stroke engine in any engine how a self start works today i am going to tell you about that as you can see there are two main components of a self start this is a solenoid and this is a motor what happens that in a self start system there is a battery of say 12 volt and when we press the self ignition button this the 12 volt comes here and it takes current when current is generated into this coil this solenoidal shaft moves backward as you can see when coil will gen coil will have current it will move backward when this will move backward this will move upward this is a clamp like this which will move upward and it is connected to the pinion this pinion will respectively move upward and finally it will be it will connect to the flywheel flywheel has a ring gear around its circumference so when pinion will mesh with the, the teeth of this flywheel gear then flywheel will rotate now how it will rotate there is a motor which takes a large amount of current when we press the self ignition start button a large amount of current is drawn from the battery so for a small instant of time a large current is drawn through this motor and respectively the pinion rotates and the flywheel is rotated and when flywheel is rotates we get a strokes in the cylinder up and down and then injection process is started and charge intake process is started and whenever the first power stroke is obtained in any of the cylinder then the uh, then the momentum is obtained in a flywheel and then uh, engine starts we will be explaining the further aspects of this digital in the next videos thank you